Hey everyone, welcome back to the Hidden Brick, where today we're going to build the Lego City, um, I guess, space vehicle. They don't have a name on here. I forget what this is called, but it's a, um, it's a poly bag that they're giving away for free as of right now at the recording of this video um, with a relatively small qualifying purchase at Shop at Home, only $35 and you get this free poly bag. So it's about a, a four to five dollar value, this poly bag is. But it's cool because it's highlighting the new space theme that came out for, I guess, space sub theme of Lego City. Um, so it's, it's like they're trying to introduce you to the, the sub theme with some, some free Lego and in hopes that you will buy more of the themes, more of the the space sets that are with the theme. So there's an instruction book that was more or less an instruction sheet that was just folded over into the set. And you can just see a minimal amount of pieces. So we'll go ahead and get the minifigure built. And I'm really excited about the whole sub theme, the space th sub theme because when I came out of my dark ages, it was right when the previous space theme was being discontinued. So I didn't collect a lot of the last wave of space. So I'm kind of excited about being introduced to the sub theme again. So there's our one minifigure. And you can see it's just a basic minifigure head. The torso is printed pretty nicely on the front and back. And then it has this big space headpiece with the tanks behind it. And then the big gold face mask, which you could take off and see his face and snap it back on. So that is the minifigure. Now we're gonna quickly move on to the actual kind of exploring buggy space vehicle. The instructions for this set are kind of classic style instructions where they don't show you the parts needed for each step. You more or less have to just look at the, the next picture and figure out what needs to be added at each step. It's kind of the way when I was little, when we got sets, that's the way the instructions were written back then. They were pretty minimalistic and you had to figure out what pieces were needed for each step. All right. So we have the big radar dish, and then we have the smaller one that attaches right there on the side. <clears throat> we have four wheels and tires. And I, I like these wheels because they're solid on one side, and then they have the little pin hole on the other side. And it's for these smaller pins. It's not a standard Technic pin hole size. It's actually a smaller one. So when you attach it, you can see it looks like there's hubcaps or some sort of solid wheel on there. And that is it for the entire build. 
So you can see it's a real simple little vehicle that has the uh, rotating dish on the back and then some sort of smaller light type dish on the side. So there you go. So that's it for this build. Thanks for watching. Make sure to check out my other videos. Subscribe if you're not subscribed and we'll see you next time.